What is up, my crazy subscribers? Daniel here. Damn, Daniel, back at it again with the. <sighs> oh my God! I swear to God, if I hear one more of these or being shared on Facebook, I'm just gonna. Damn, Daniel. Damn, Daniel. Damn, Daniel. Damn. I swear to god the trends of nowadays, they're just as entertaining as a set of keys. Like you just get your youngest sibling, sit him in front of you. Like he better be like under 5 years old. Get your pair of keys, just get your set of keys and just start wiggling in front of them. Just wiggle the set of keys in front of your kid and he will start laughing out of nowhere. That's how most of the trends are, like they're just that stupid. So um, so yeah like what the fuck damn Daniel is trending on fucking Facebook like crazy. A lot of women in my Facebook right now are fucking pedophiles. I swear to God. Every time I see a new damn Daniel video being posted up, I'm like, all right, let me check the comment section. I click the comment section. I swear to God, these like 28 to 30 year old women commenting like how cute this kid is and how they want to take him home. I'm like, isn't this kid like 17 years old or something? And all these women like fucking, you know, having sexual fantasies in their mind and they want to take this kid home. I'm like, what the fuck? That's fucked up, man. A lot of pedophiles on Facebook. And, you know, they think it's only men, but it's also women, man. The fucking, fucking perverted fucks on Facebook. So, uh, so yeah, you know, damn Daniel's getting a lot of attention. And another thing that happened also lately was that he got his ass kicked for his white vans. I'm like, what? I found that out because, you know, one of my one of my teammates told me on, on Call of Duty Black Ops 3, Austin PD. And, um... I checked it up on Facebook and it's true apparently. It's true that he got his ass kicked. According to Facebook though, I have not seen any videos, I haven't seen it in any news outlet outlets. So um I still need more confirmation on that. Did he, did he actually get his ass kicked for his white fans? And um if he did, the kids that beat him up, they are fucking stupid. Cause those shoes are only worth like forty bucks. What the fuck are they gonna do? And another thing that I heard from Austin PD was that they are starting to selling his shoes like for over a hundred bucks on eBay. The fuck, <laughs> the fuck is going on nowadays, man? This generation is fucked. I don't know what the hell's going on at school, but I graduated a few years ago, and I'm glad, you know, I'm glad I'm not part of those trends because I know that was the the Harlem Shake, the Gangnam Style, the Ice Bucket Challenge, uh, the Don't Judge Me Challenge. That shit was fucked up, to be honest. The freaking people from Vine, man. You know what they did? These people mocked people who felt insecure about themselves and what they did was they put makeup you know all these hot chicks all these fucking fine looking dudes just being honest you know um they put on like ugly ass makeup you know they're putting fucking put the uh, the unibrow the fucking fake pimples and then they, they pretty much put their hands in front of the camera took it off and you know they look like fucking supermodels that's fucked up because that's gonna make fucking people who are insecure like how come i don't look like that you know fuck I'll kill myself like that's fucked up so to me, you know, the people from Vine are fucked up people. Good, good thing I didn't develop over there, you know, because I wanted to go to Vine at some point. I'm like, nah, it's going to stay on YouTube because YouTube has more of a, you know, of a crowd here. So, yeah, fuck the people from Vine, man. So anyways, man, trains nowadays are stupid as fuck, man. I swear. <laughs> I swear. I'm glad I'm not in high school. Because uh, another trend that was going on through my times in middle school and maybe even by high school was the dances. You know, the jerk, the Dougie. Uh, some other stupid shit. No. Trans, man. Trans really kill the mood sometimes. And yes, I did laugh at this video like for the first day. I was like, damn, you know, that damn Daniel one is pretty good. Hopefully it doesn't repeat itself. And and then people started sharing that shit on Facebook. I fucking became cancer after that. And people are still sharing it till, day, till today. You know, it's crazy. After seven days, that thing is still trending. And, um... I don't find it funny anymore. Like, women, stop sharing this shit. Please, and stop being pedophiles on Facebook. Calm down. You know, calm your tits. <laughs> so, uh, my thoughts on this, to be honest, my opinion, is that, damn Daniel, yeah, it was funny at first, but stop. Just, you big YouTubers on Facebook, just stop sharing it. Please, it's annoying at this point. Like, I don't care about white vans anymore. I own a pair of fucking gray vans, but I'm thinking of, I'm changing it now. I'm not going to fucking wear vans anymore. You know, that's what that's what's gonna kill under the star right there. Because of this stupid trend. So uh, so yeah guys, that's my opinion. What do you guys think about this trend? You know, is it stupid? Is it good? Does it make you laugh? If it does if it does make you laugh, I gotta get myself a break and slap you with it, because it's ridiculous. So I'll see you guys later and subscribe for more.